Hi, it's Pia. I'm Sarah from The Upcoming. A pleasure to speak to you. Um, if you could just give us an intro to your film, Anna Malia, what can people expect when they watch it? I don't expect that people love the film because I think that we, should, we shouldn't make film to make people love a movie, but I, I expect that people will will be... I want people to emerge in a world, in different world, and question themselves. I think that we are, we are living in a, la, in a pretty, you know, fast life. And taking the time, you know, to just questioning yourself and your society, it's really important moment. And I hope that the film will, like, will give the space for, for that, that time. And can you tell us a bit about why you wanted to tell the story and particularly the genre you sort of decide to tell it through? It's a supernatural drama set in the Atlas Mountain. Uh, it's a, a journey of a young woman who is pregnant and will face, face supernatural events um, here in Morocco, but those supernatural events happen all around the world. And why is it important for you to have your film here at the Marrakesh Film Festival, particularly being the 20th edition yeah. and representing, you know, amazing female talent such yeah. as yours? Well, first, I'm very proud because I'm half Moroccan. I live in Morocco and in Rabat, so having the, my, my, the premiere of my film here uh, in Morocco after Sendant, because it premiered actually in Sendant in January, is really important um, because, yeah, we're making movies that travel all around the world, but showing them to people uh, from your country is, I think, the most important thing. Moroccan cinema has a long history, so it's really hard to speak like we are a new wave. It's, I think it's a bit complicated to speak like this, but that, that's sure that um, there's a new generation because I think there's this colonial relation with uh, European countries. And, um, and as a French Moroccan woman, being a director, I used to live in France for a very long time. And I've been confronted um, on this idea that we should make one type of movies, you know. And I was, I grew up in China, I used to live in different country, and I didn't feel like I was inspired by many directors from all around the world. So this idea of making what call people sci-fi using supernatural uh, in a real, real realistic story is something that was really important to me. So it's really complicated for me to speak as a new way, but I think that we want to escape from this stereotypical uh, vision of uh, what Arab cinema should be. I think that's more than any country. Yeah, I'm working in different type of movies and uh, it's it's in writing. I'm reading a lot of short stories. I'm working also on the TV side. On a, uh, there's a, a, a book that we're working on adaptation. Uh, I'm working on an English language movie, but at the same time an Arab language movie. Yeah.